If you are stressed out about a health concern, this video is for you. I'll guide you through a tapping exercise you can use to relieve some of that stress. Hi, I'm Lisa Reed. I'm a certified clinical EFT practitioner. Be sure to check the description below for more information and to access all of my free resources, including a worksheet to create your own tapping script. So before we start tapping, let's do three steps. First, we want to name the problem. And in this case, it is a health concern. So if you can take some notes um, and just write down that problem. And then next, we want to give it a number. So rate it on a scale from zero to 10 with zero being this doesn't stress me out at all or 10 being this could not be any worse. So what number would you give your level of stress about this problem? And then notice, so notice what thoughts and feelings and body sensations come up when you think about this problem. You know, what emotion comes with it? And is there like a tightness in your chest or a queasiness in your stomach or whatever um, other body sensations come up when you focus on this problem? So we'll start with a general round of tapping and we'll use the tapping points on the side of the hand, the top of the head, the eyebrow point, the outside of the eye, under the eye, under the nose, under the lip, the collarbone point, and the side of the ribs. So just tap along with me and repeat the words that I say, or you can just insert your own, but just focus on how you feel about this problem. So we'll start on the side of the hand. Even though I'm worried about this health issue, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. And if you need to substitute something else in that second half of that statement, then go ahead. Just find something that works for you. So even though I have this health concern, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. And even though I'm worried about this health issue, I am working on accepting myself. This health concern, I am really stressed out about this. And on a scale from zero to 10, I give it a number of, and then state your number. And this is how it affects me. This is how I feel it in my body. And these are the thoughts that I have about this. Now we'll get a little bit more specific about this problem. So just go back to the top of the head and tap and, and identify the specifics. What health problem are you thinking about? If you have more than one, just focus on the one that's troubling you the most. Just keep tapping. Is it um, something that you just don't know what is wrong, what the diagnosis is. Or maybe it's something that you don't know how long this is going to last. You don't really know what to do about it. Maybe you do know, but it's just stressing you out because of what you have to, to endure, the things that you um, have to do to address this problem. So just think about the details and think if, are there any other people involved in this? So are others affected by it? Maybe people who will need to care for you or the people that you won't get to see because of this. Just think of the people related to this issue. Maybe it's the, um, practitioner that you're seeing. Think about those people. And then where in your body is this health issue? Just think about that. Is it just a specific area or is it all over or multiple areas? Just tap, focus on that part of your body. And then think about when did 
does this bother you? Is this a 24 seven kind of thing? Or is it just um, flare up at certain times? Think about those times and keep tapping. So send those calming signals. And the tapping won't cure anything, but it can help relieve some of the stress that's associated with it. Can help you calm down so that you can think about this a little bit more clearly. Now, this health issue, how long has it been going on? Is this something recent or has this been going on a very long time? And how does this affect your life? Is it keeping you from doing things that you really want to do? Or does this get you out of something that you don't want to do? So how, how does this affect you? Having this health concern, how does it affect your life? And why does this stress you out so much? Just try to answer that question. Focus on how you're feeling when you think about this problem, not necessarily the symptoms, but um, the emotions that go with it. You know, if you're angry or frustrated, you just feel impatient, just name those things and keep tapping. Now, when you think about th these emotions and these feelings and body sensations, does this remind you of something? Is there, there's a similar situation you've had in your life um, that this is reminding you of? So if so, just think about that and tap on it. Think about what you said, what you did, what you felt, what you heard during that time. And you can just tap and talk as if you're just telling a story to your best friend about this, this experience that you had. So we'll finish up this round of tapping. Now think about what is a next step that you could do? What is something that you could do to alleviate some of the stress? Is there um, a support group that you could join? Are there other practitioners you could contact? Are there um, some things that you've been told you should do, maybe exercise, um, and you've been putting that off? Can you make a plan to do that? Can you, you know, change your eating habits or, or whatever has been recommended to you. What is your next step that you can take? You don't have to figure out all the steps, but what is one next step you can take? Okay. okay, well, let's check in. So how do you feel now? What number would you give your level of stress? If you rate it higher than a two, probably wanna keep tapping. Um, but if, if not, you can just come back to this um, anytime that you're feeling stressed about this health issue. So we'll do one more round of tapping. And this time, focus on if you had this health concern resolved, how would you feel? Would there be relief? Just think about how you would feel and then try to feel that way right now. Maybe there's a, a time when you have felt that way and you can just remember that feeling. And imagine this health concern being resolved in the way that you imagine it would be, um, that would be ideal. Do one last round. Some deep breaths, tap. Okay. 
So give that a try when you're stressed out about a health issue. Thank you so much for joining me and please like, comment, share, and subscribe if you found this helpful. And also be sure to go to my website, lisacreed.com and subscribe to my email list so that you stay updated with all of my new resources. Thank you.